Hey friends, it's Brenda Stir. Thanks for tuning in. We are going to make these cute little cartoon characters today. Aren't they cute? Seriously. We're going to do them using ChatGPT for free. You've seen these little characters popping up, right? You've seen people making them. Maybe you weren't sure how to make them. I'm going to show you how to make them in about three minutes. And I'm going to show you how to do it with the free version of ChatGPT. If you have a paid version of ChatGPT, I'm going to show you how to do it even easier. Stick with me. This is what we're going to make today. Let's do it. Okay, we're over here on ChatGPT. I do have a paid version, but I'm going to show you how to do this for free. Okay, we're just going to create a prompt and I'm going to put the prompt right into this video. So go ahead and look at the YouTube description and you'll be able to see the full prompt written right there that you can take and recreate. I want to create a square cartoon graphic in a chibi style. It should be a woman with blonde with shoulder length blonde hair, blue eyes, and tortoise shell glasses, because that's what I have, right? Uh, let's see. She is wearing a long sleeve pink t-shirt and denim jeans. So when you're describing what you want your character to look like, you want to be as detailed as you can. So in this case, medium length blonde hair, blue eyes. Here we go. Okay. Actually, let's even be more specific. It is a white woman. Okay. Okay. So now what is she doing? She is uh, laughing and holding her mobile phone. That's it. That's the prompt. Let's see what we get. It's gonna think for a second. It's gonna, I'm gonna do some editing magic right now. And with editing magic, 30 seconds later, the graphic is done. Isn't that awesome? Okay, so here's our cute little graphic. Does it look like me? I don't know. I think maybe it looks kind of like me. I could pull that off. There we go. So you can use that same prompt over and over and over again. Now here's what you can also do. You could take it one step further. You could specify a certain color code, like if I wanted her long sleeve pink t-shirt to be light pink, the color of my shirt I'm wearing right now, that you wanted it to be a little more specific, you can actually give a color code that matches your branding. So if you want to come back into the same thread, you can just keep on asking her for, or asking ChatGPT for the same graphic continually. Now put her on a bicycle, now have her laying on the couch, now have her talking on her phone. So you can kind of see looking at mine, I make a lot of these. I make a lot of these little gals, okay? This is my little Brenda avatar. She's super fun. She pops up in little surprise, unexpected ways around my social content. Now, if you have a paid level of chat GPT, I want you to do it in projects. So over here in projects, here's what you're going to do. You're gonna go into projects. You're gonna create a new project. Now mine is already called Sweet Graphics and you're going to put those instructions right into the project. This project will create graphics for my business. The graphics will always be square, designed in a chibi style, and always be a, this is my character, what she looks like, tortoiseshell glasses. The colors in all images will draw from approved hex codes. And then here are the hex codes for my business. Then follow prompt specific instructions. So I only have to write it once by putting the instructions into the project instructions. So then when I go in and I say, okay, show me a blonde woman who's excited and holding a Diet Coke. It's following those base instructions without me having to repeat it over and over and over again. So this was one, like, are you considering ChatGPT free? pro or plus. I can, there's a thinker right there, right? She should look like she's considering which one to get following the base instructions. So it's very, very easy to create these fun little avatars, little graphics, little hints of personality back into your business in a new and creative way. So like I said, go ahead and take a look at the description for this video. I put the prompt right there, tweak it for your own design, um, woman with brown hair, a man with gray hair, wearing glasses, has a beard, wearing denim, wearing a long coat, whatever you want it to be. 
make it your own. The big thing though is to specify that it's a chibi style graphic and they're all gonna kind of have that visual aesthetic. Hope you found this super in interesting. Follow along for more tips, AI, social media, social marketing for direct and social sellers. See you again soon.